humans are facing unprecedented challenges in the food security arena. We are going to have 50% more people between 2000 and 2050. All of those mouths have to be fed somehow. Many of them will be located in the developing world where we hope that incomes will be substantially higher, which means they're going to be demanding more and better food. So those food security challenges, meeting those demands, are going to be really challenging. On top of that, climate change is like a threat multiplier. What it means is that everything you have to do to meet the food security challenges without climate change is that much harder. It's useful to review the basics of climate change. Sometime between now and 2050, the temperatures will increase on average over the surface of the Earth, about a degree Celsius. Um, that increase means that crops that are used to being grown under current temperature conditions and current precipitation conditions are going to face things and farmers are going to face things that they haven't passed. Without any kind of adaptation, yields will necessarily go down and the extent of the yield decline depends upon where you are and what kind of climate future we eventually end up with. But the, the yield declines range from uh, relatively small numbers or even increases in a few places to substantial declines 40, 50, 60 percent in places like South Asia for wheat. Now those declines are with current varieties and current practices and farmers have been adjusting for millennia. So they will compensate for some of these changes but it, it's a compensation that they need to do on top of the other challenges related to food security.